Hello guys, I'm Lucinel and welcome back to I the Somnium Files. Last time I just I went through the probably worst route possible in this game. I don't know, there might be one that is even worse, but I feel like I'm definitely going for the bad ending. So two people died. Iris and Dota. I just can't express how much I hate that. And uh, we're gonna continue on that route. We found out who the Cyclops killers are, at least from Pewter's information, who are the Rohan Kumakura, I believe, the, the previous uh, leader of the y uh, Yakuza, and then uh, prisoner number 89 from, uh, yeah, from the, who is serving a life sentence, who apparently was taken into custody and yeah who we're getting information from on uh who the cyclops killer is so hopefully we will be able to contact him but anyway guys uh we're gonna keep it going hope we enjoy the episode i'm hoping for better stuff this time because things got really really serious real fast and i don't i don't enjoy this anyway guys thank you once again i'm los and l and i'll see you guys next time so anyway guys let's keep it going let's keep it moving and enjoy <laughs> Look at the flashback. We were shocked. We woke up. We saw these two being killed. The interrogation. We checked the warehouse. And we're probably going through another sad part, which is going. I want to go uh, to. Not to Matsushita dinner just yet, because I feel like that's going to be even sadder. Let's go to Marble first. Let's take a. Let's chill a little bit. Before we actually go into the sad stuff. Because, who oh boy, this is gonna be... Yeah, it's gonna be a doozy. Are you okay, honey? A big doozy. Uh, about last night. Well, at three in the morning, anyway. You know about it? It's on every channel. You have the face of a ghost. Do you want a glass? I'd rather not. I don't need a drink. I need yeah. information. Do you have anything? Well, let's see. I do have... I suppose you could call it intuition. Tell me. Okay. Information about the incident. Just, just please tell me. The Kumakuras are involved in this case. Oh. Remember what I told you before? That there's a relationship between Ren and the Kumakuras? Uh -huh. Shoko also has a relationship with them. You know about her dealings with the Kumakuras, right? Sure so do. basically, two of the victims are linked to the Kumakuras. That must mean they're involved somehow, right? Not two. Three. Three? Okay. Iris? No, not that one. The boy. Okay. He came here last night. Uh-huh. Ota? Yes, from Matsushita Diner. He's linked to the Kumakuras as well. Wow. I imagine that's why, yeah, when he shocked us, he was smiling. So it probably was a goon from the Kumakuras. Have you heard the rumor? Mama told me a similar story to Ibis about Sosajima and the Kawasaki <sighs> District. Oh, right, right, right. The basic idea is this. Eight years ago, so sold his hand in the Kawasaki district for 30 billion yen. Half a year later, an explosion of the chemical plant ca caused the land pr uh, prices to drop drastically. So uh, he bought back the land for 1 billion yen. Almost like he knew beforehand that the accident would happen. Uh, did so blow it up or conspire to blow it up? Uh, that wouldn't make sense. So wouldn't gain anything from that. He wouldn't... He would end up with 29 billion yen and 1 billion in land. It's a net zero. Oh, so like he wouldn't actually... Okay, there's more to the story. Uh, maybe he needed physical money? So, so... Or at least the Kumakuras must have been part of the incident. About so and the Kawasaki district. The Kumakuras own a handful of real estate companies. Oh. They of course look legit, but they're Yakuza fronts. I'll call those real estate companies the K.E. to keep it simple for you. Okay. The K.E. followed in So's footsteps. They bought up land in Kabasaki. Oh, so they bought land from So, right? Now, back to So. Have you heard of the plans for the casino in Kabasaki? Oh. So was the one who came up with it. Huh. I was born and raised in Kabasaki. I remember the landscape of my childhood. And I loved it dearly. But look at Kabasaki now. When I see images of the destruction on television, my heart aches like it's being chopped to pieces. But I hmm. promise you, I will revive the Kabasaki district at any cost. He sounds like a personified villain. <laughs> Casino town Kabasaki will give new life to the city. What? 
A casino, really? After that, so moved fast. He submitted the bills he needed to the National Assembly after drumming up support in the right places. The bills passed and it became an official government initiative. So is it still happening? Efforts, therefore increased at a rapid pace in the Kawasaki uh, district. Okay. At the moment, the area is still considered off limits. The air in Kawasaki is currently purified to such an extent that it has no negative effect on the human body. I just, I need to snap out of it. I'm sorry. I'm just like not concentrated at all. If the plan goes smoothly, land prices in Kabasaki are going to skyrocket. And all that land is owned by the KE. Huh. And by So himself. Okay. The land he bought back for one billion will be worth ten times that soon. He's involved in some shady business. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. But what does that have to do with the killings? You know what I mean? Let's keep it this going. This is just another rumor, but the chemical plant exploding was no accident. It was done intentionally. I can see that. By so in the Kumakuras, you mean. Mm -hmm. But there's no hard evidence of that. Right. It's just gossip. What about Ota and the Kumakuras? Uh, what were we talking about again? What? Ota and the Kumakuras. Right. Oh, right. Uh -huh. You know how Matsushita Diner is close to the Kabasaki district? Yeah. Wow, it's right there. The chemical plant explosion made times hard. Mm. Food traffic went down, sales declined. No wonder it closed down. Oda okay. was told a grudge. Someone caused that explosion. Mm -hmm. And if it was intentional, oh, he'd hate them even more. <laughs> That's how I link Ota to the Kumakuras. Okay. But that doesn't mean that they're allies, that means they're enemies. Anyway, I mean, I guess that's all the info we can get from her. Say goodbye. Thank you, Mama. I yeah. don't know if what you told me will lead to anything, but... <laughs> I don't oh, know if this will help. Sorry. I didn't mean to waste your time. No, no, no. No, no, it was mm -hmm. very helpful. I'm glad I can help, even if it's just a little. Well then, be seeing you. <laughs> Come back anytime. Please tell me there's like a true ending or something like this. Like, these are all bad endings or like endings that don't lead to the whole picture and then there will be a full ending because it will really suck to solve the mystery on the bad ending i don't know to me because like then if we go to the good endings uh to the good routes i mean it will really suck to be like you know what i mean let's go to the second residence this is gonna be freaking sad second residence monday still monday when i visited the Sagan household i found hitomi with a hollow look in her face she let me in and asked me to see it on the sofa. I agreed and sat down. But after that, I couldn't say a single word. The heavy silence waited on both of us. <laughs> she looks so sad. Again, I just I just edited the episode where... Uh, oh my gosh, this music is gonna kill me. <laughs> where uh, we hang out with uh, Ace and her. The flower. In the language of flowers, the iris means good news and hope. When I saw the flowers this morning, I just knew something good would happen. I want to I want I actually want to break this controller. I just iris. <laughs> the winter iris is blooming. Sure is. <sighs> it's Tommy's composed. She's hiding her sorrow deep in her heart. She's gentle, but strong. Can you think of any information? I guess. It told me my entire focus is on this case. Is there anything at all you can tell me? Oh. Are we gonna have I don't to sink? Know if this is important, but no, please tell me. I may have told you this already. I met Renju's wife Shoko twice before. Mm -hmm. The first time at the wedding, the second time a month ago. That second time was in the waiting room of the prison. Oh. Prison. There's an acquaintance of mine from when we were younger. I visit them a few times a year. Oh. By coincidence, I saw Shoko. I don't think she noticed me, but I recognized her as Renju's wife right away. She was there for the same reason I was, to visit one of the inmates. Do you know who? Oh. No, I don't. Right. I didn't talk. Which prison? Fuchu Prison mm -hmm. in Tokyo. Number 89. Prison. I'm Aurota. Oda was one of my students. Oh. I taught him in elementary school. I heard it from the police. Oda tried to help Iris and ended up... I don't know what to say. I have no words. 
There's nothing to say. This just sucks. Honestly. Oh, the picture. There's a drawing on the wall. Is that number 89? Or no, 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 no. That, that, this has got to be the who she was meeting at the prison, right? Maybe? I don't know. But Iris. Iris was my everything. We always went everywhere together. Whether it was buying clothes or going to the movies or taking a walk or going shopping at the supermarket. When she was young, <sighs> she would just hold one of my fingers. Her hand was too small to hold mine. Then it was two, then three. And finally, she could hold my hand. But eventually, <laughs> she left my hands altogether. Mm. She started crossing her arms, being independent, even though she needed constant attention growing up. She doesn't show a single sign that she might break down in front of me. She stays as dignified and composed. But I can tell that she's so close to breaking, so close to crumbling away. Like a flame slowly eating at the edges of paper before the whole thing catches fire. Her memories are a part of this room. And always will be. When she was a baby. Damn it. She fell off that sofa and cried and cried. One day she tore up her picture book all over the floor here. Another time she drew with crayons all over the window. She painted my portrait on Mother's Day. Scratches on the floor. Chipped plates. Burn marks on the table. Stains on the cushions. Everything you see. It all holds a memory of her. But... Why? Capital H hate this. Is that it? I'm sorry to have bothered you. I'll be going now. Thinking about her... Dante, please, you, you have to catch them. Oh, hell yeah, we're catching them. Please, please. I will. Trust me. This person, whoever they are, maybe it's headquarters. Should we go to the diner? Uh, I feel like this is gonna be even sadder. I hope we get something at the end of this, because this is so sad so far. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. The place was silent. It was so quiet, I felt like I could hear the floating dust. I stepped inside. I thought it was empty, but I saw a shadow in the corner of my eye. Oh... It was Mayumi. It was like watching a decaying old tree clinging pathetically to the earth. I don't know if I can do this. Sorry to interrupt about that. Uh, they want to talk about it. I'm sorry to interrupt. Yeah, I mean, let's apologize first. She's looking at uh, photographs in her hand. Do you want to talk about it? Lorata. This is your fault. Well, this is great. I heard from the police because you didn't take care of Iris. My boy Ota got involved. Date, I looked into the investigation report. Mayumi confirmed Ota's body early this morning. I see. Oh. I'm sorry. I want to be alone right now. That's okay. Did you not hear me? I said leave! <laughs> Date, let's go. She is in no state to talk. Yeah, you're right. I just, I don't know, I don't know, it's, I mean, it's hard in these situations, because, like, I understand, <laughs> like, we're still looking for the person, for the responsible, so I don't know, that residence, Monday, monday.com, <laughs> oh, I didn't even, I didn't even think of that, why didn't I think of that, and she's gonna be angry at us, because we left her, she looked like a small animal frightened by a predator, it's like his bed. Is this a room? The entrance? Oh no, that's the entrance. Okay. Bench press. <laughs> Mine and Mizuki's clothes. They're all the... <laughs> all the cartoon character clothes. Man, I wish we would have seen this in better circumstances. <laughs> Skull bag. Backpack. What? Why is there an iron pipe? What? Mizuki's a favorite metal pipe. 
Okay, does she just carry it to defend herself or something? If so, more power to her, honestly. <laughs> How about a cure uh, fishery, coal storage, warehouse? I don't... I don't like any of those options. Photo tab or iris. Miss Vicky's staring at the floor. Borota. She's, yeah, she's not gonna be able to talk about Iris. Yeah, no, I don't... I wish we could just skip through this, I don't Mizuki wanna... must know about Iris and Ota. Oh, yeah. Of course, the news was distributed heavily across the internet, not just in Japan, but worldwide. Wow. Three days ago, Mizuki discovered her mother's body. Two days ago, her father's. This morning, two of her best friends. It is completely understandable that she is at her mental limit. Poor Carol, man. This Can I be left sucks. alone for a while? Oh, yeah. Are you okay? I don't... Yeah. She certainly didn't seem so. But I can't stay by her side forever. Iba, contact Abyss. See if they can get Mizuki a good counselor. Yeah. Understood. It's whatever the cost is, I just... Please. <laughs> I stayed with her for a while, but we didn't speak. Having nothing more to say, I left. Alright, time to go to Abyss. Now that we're done with this, uh, sad times. Hopefully we can move on to something other than that. Ooh, Monday 4.47, did it say? I return to boss's office to report. But I didn't see her anyway. This is bad. Where did she go? Well, she isn't always here, correct? Sure. True. Mm hmm Sat down in my usual seat and decided to wait for bus. Oh, hi. <laughs> what are you doing? I thought it would be easier to talk like this. <laughs> what do we have to talk about? A summary of the investigation, perhaps? Sure. What summary? We don't have anything new. I love how she has the, like, I check back and she has very, very similar hair to the to, to boss. That's not true. Huh? I was curious, so I did some research about number 89. Mm-hmm. What is the relationship between 89 and Shoko? Who is 89? What's 89's real name? What about 89 and the new Cyclops killings? Um, who is 89? As you know, he is an assassin with multiple confirmed kills. He okay. is currently serving a sentence at Fuchu Prison. He was imprisoned six years ago. Do we have a twin? That's what Pewter told us. Hmm. After his fourth murder, he was arrested by the police. Mm hmm But under different charges. What were the charges? Uh, what is their real name? What about 89 and the new Cyclops killing? Let's ask about the real name. Unknown. You don't know? I... No such person is listed in the family registry. It is possible he is a foreigner, but his nationality is unknown. Huh. However, I believe it is safe to say that he was born and raised in Japan. Understandable. What about 89 and the new Cyclops serial killings? Pewter claims that there were two culprits behind the original serial killings. Okay. One was the former chairman of the Kumakuras, Rohan Kumakura. Mm-hmm. But Rohan committed suicide last year. Right. That leaves one culprit still alive. Number 89. But number yep. 89 couldn't possibly have committed these crimes. He was in jail when each of the murders occurred. Right. Correct. Mm hmm However, I do not believe it is accurate to claim that he had nothing to do with the incident. Okay, I get that. I know who killed Shogun Adami. Mm hmm If he was telling the truth, his involvement is possible. I guess so. Was there a relationship between 89 and Shoko? Unknown. I cannot determine if they have any connection. Ooh. Approximately one month ago, Hitomi Sagan witnessed Shoko in Fuchu Prison's waiting room. I am <laughs> unable to say for certain that the person she was there to visit was number 89. After <laughs> all, Fuchu Prison houses 2,000 inmates. Jeez. But number 89 knew Shoko's name. Okay. I know who killed Shoko Nadami. Yeah, he did. That must mean that he knew her somehow. Mm -hmm. It is possible. It's pretty possible. Let's talk to 89. Can we talk with him? Let's talk to number 89. I don't know if he's telling the truth or if he's just full of it. But he's our last remaining loose All end. Right. Yeah. However, we need not go to him. We can bring him to us. If oh. we plan on sinking with him, it would be more efficient. Can oh. you arrange that? I yeah. can. Can we sink with him? From what? After cutting through some red tape, 
89 was to be brought to HQ. It took considerable time to arrive, but for some reason, Buzz never showed up. Ah, uh, this sucks. I don't like this. Monday, 8.56 p.m. This is really bad. Hi. Here he is. Huh. He does look pretty similar to us. Huh. Maybe that's why... Oh. Does he know him? Sorry to interrupt your busy day, but I need <laughs> you to tell me something. I'd appreciate your cooperation. Uh, where are you from? You're the original Cyclops killer. What's your name? Mm, where are you from? Let's, let's, let's Burkina start with that. Burkina Faso. Burkina Faso is a republic in West Africa. Population 17 million. I don't have time for your jokes. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't sound right. Uh, what's your name? So you're going to joke? Your real name. I don't remember. What? You're the original Cyclops killer? That's right. I was oh. one of the culprits behind the case six years ago. Okay. One of the two Cyclops killers. I like your voice. Just saying. <laughs> 89 is sitting in front of me. Do you know Shoko Nadami? Yeah, I guess I do. About a mm. month ago, Shoko visited Fuchu Prison. Was she there to see you? That's right. What did mm -hmm. you talk about? Nothing special. You're in no position to lie. I'm not yeah. lying. She didn't come to hear me talk. Then why did she come? To Ooh. meet me meet you she probably just wanted to see me why when did you first meet shoko a long time ago i don't remember exactly when what's your relationship to her a physical one damn i'm kidding she was just a business partner. <laughs> okay why did i laugh at that i don't know i'm just looking for <laughs> grasping for the smallest amount of comedy in this game all right Let's get right down to it. Two days ago, you called Investigation HQ and said, I know who killed Shoko Nadami. Mm-hmm. That's right. Who? Okay. Hey, don't be so hasty. Oh. We haven't agreed on a deal. You're gonna let me out of prison, right? What? It's done. You've got a deal. Oh. All right. But to explain it properly, I need to tell you a story. Are we really gonna leave him out of prison? It might take some time. Is that all right with I you? mean, I, under I understand that that is I've desperate. got nothing but time. Oh, yeah. Then let's oh, get started. Kind of. <laughs> let's do the it. Story of a lonely assassin. Uh-huh. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Because maybe this won't... This, oh, it Once will be all about the There was a detective full of righteous justice. Let's call him F. F found the evils of the world intolerable. F had no parents, no siblings, and grew up in an orphanage since he was born. He suffered every mm. kind of abuse imaginable there. It led him to despise all the evils of the world. Okay. One day, F was chasing a thug down at the harbor. Someone wanted for the assault and murder of women. Oh, the music. Okay, I get it. I'll just throw down my knife. Here. And you lower your gun. It's fine. I got nothing else on me. I'll go quietly. Hmm. You know, I have a history with hospitals. I've been going to a special hospital for a while. Even if I get caught, it's all good. I'll come right back out again. Wow. What should I do next time? Just thinking about it gets me excited. Ugh. Damn. The culprit was unarmed, but F never served a day in prison. The case went to trial for some time, but it was determined to be self-defense, and he was declared innocent. Wow. Is he Iris's father? I, l I love how the music... <sighs> if the truth got out, it would be a huge scandal for the people at the upper level were Sorry. terrified of what might happen. So they had evidence fabricated. F wasn't suspended or disciplined at all. Wow. After a while, he returned to his job like nothing happened. That's messed up. Very messed up. That was a turning point for him. He uh. was ready to shed the morality that was weighing him down, holding him back. F still wanted justice, and he was willing to dispense it to the immoral one by one. He wow. became an assassin, a lone gunman. 
No agent, no employer. He was his own man. F believed that he was judge, jury, and executioner. But it didn't last long. One day, F got rid of a criminal we'll call X. X was responsible for defrauding and killing an innocent old man for his life insurance policy. Turns okay. out, X had connections. Mm -hmm. Someone wasn't happy that he died. Rohan <laughs> Kumakura, chairman of the Kumakuras. Wow. X was a top executive of the Kumakuras at the time. Rohan ordered his men to find and kidnap F. I can't believe that's actually... I really thought... I've done some research. He was a killer. Wow. I know you've cleaned up at least 18 pieces of scum from this earth. Mm -hmm. Somehow there hasn't been a single criminal investigation. <laughs> They're all treated as suicides, accidents, or natural causes. Amazing work. I'm impressed. How about you work for us? Of course, you have the right to say no, but it'll be the last word out of your mouth. Hmm. F was trapped. Even if he somehow survived, he would be looking over his shoulder for the rest of his life. He had no choice but to take Rohan's offer. You're really making F sound like a victim here. <laughs> Thus, F's self-employment came to an end. The room. He became a hired gun of the Kumakuras. Rohan even gave him a code name, Falco. Falco. Named for the falcon, wow. a bird of prey. <laughs> Interesting. Falco what didn't quit twist. his job as a police officer, though. He worked as a detective by day, assassin by night at the huh. will of the organization. An ordinary killer would need motive to take a life, not Falco. <laughs> he did as he was told, one target after another. Jeez. It didn't take long to destroy his heart completely. Hmm. It's crazy. Time passed, and a few years back, Falco, okay. who by this time was exhausted in body and spirit, made a fatal mistake. He Ooh. missed his mark and ended up taking a bullet to the stomach. Somehow, he managed to escape. After reaching huh. a nearby shrine, his legs finally gave out under him. He had no strength left. He put his back up against the shrine and let out a moaning breath that he thought might be his last. Okay. But at that moment, in yeah. his darkening vision, he saw a woman approach him. Why? Yeah, I knew he it. He watched her take out her phone and dial for help. At the same time, he heard footsteps. Oh. Footsteps of at least two people closing in. He knew immediately that they were after him. Oh. He sprung into action, grabbing the woman and pulling her close, kissing her to keep her from talking. Oh. Wasn't that she? was the first encounter between Falco and the woman. She was a teacher at some school. It was uh -huh. like she was from a totally different world than him. Listening to her talk, he would forget everything about his line of work. That's the... Uh... So he's the guy in the picture. She was his only contact with the ordinary, mundane world. In the in the drawing that Iris did. They met in secret a few more times, and Falco felt his heart grow warmer. Hmm. Her smile and kindness were like a cold glass of water for Falco's parched heart. Falco started to become himself again. His former self, he swore on his life that from then on, he would live for her. Wow. So... You want to go clean? Fine. Do as you please. You've done a lot for us. But there is one last thing. One final job I want you to do for me. Uh, I think I'm burning out of space in my face cam. Yeah, I think it's... Hold on, I'm gonna let this pass. It's nothing major. This woman and her daughter. I need you oh, to dispose wow. of them. Should be simple, no? And it's the... Rohan handed Falco a picture of a woman and a girl. It was the teacher Falco met at the shrine. Mm -hmm. And her daughter. She had just turned 12. There you go. Okay, I'm back. Let's keep it going. Why the two of them? Rohan, as usual, never gave a reason. And Falco had no intention of carrying out the kill. But if right. he didn't, he knew that someone else would. Wait, so... He thought long and hard. How is he going to keep them safe and get out of the life of crime? 
He couldn't find an answer, no matter how hard he thought. He was backed into a corner. Hmm. So, he decided to call on an old friend for help. And then... Whoa, 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 whoa. An old friend? Huh? Silence. For some reason, he wouldn't open his mouth again. The heck? My guy? Because we saw her dead in her memories. What is the connection between death and Shoko? Why did you stop? Was that the whole story? You mentioned a detective. Uh, why did you stop? Why did you stop? Okay, it's not talking. Was that the whole story? Was that the whole story? Oh. Uh, sometimes he says it and sometimes he doesn't. <laughs> you mentioned a detective. What's the connection between that? Yeah. What's the connection between that and Shoko? Come on, man. Hey, answer me. <laughs> His face this like is a transaction, remember? Oh. Until I get a guarantee that you'll uphold your end of the bargain. I'm not telling you anything else. Wow. I'll give you half up front, half later. <laughs> that, oh, that's messed up. If you up. want to hear the rest of my story, you better start the release procedures. Once they've cleared, I'll tell you everything. Oh my gosh, that, that's gonna take a while, isn't it? Date, it is unlikely that number 89 will uphold his promise, even upon release. Very unlikely. Yeah. You know. Yes? Start the preparations. For what? What do you think? <clears throat> the sink. Oh. Uh, oh, this is gonna be weird. I mean, I have time, but like, <laughs> it's so much stuff happening. Okay. Damn. Are you ready, Agent Date? Yeah. The time limit is six minutes. Okay. I know. And where is Boss? I am so afraid because we haven't seen Boss. She's not the killer. Nah, there's no way. All right, here we go. Mm-hmm. What is this gonna be? Oh, is it the room? Yeah. It sure is. Sup? <laughs> no, not sup. Why are you sleeping on the job? <laughs> oh. Because I want to, obviously. <laughs> Why are you getting mad at me? <laughs> right. Oh, this rug feels so good on my skin, yeah. Why are you suddenly a cat? Yeah. Playtime's over. What Let's the? begin. Stand up. <laughs> You're this throwing me off. Residence? Yep. It definitely is. Why? Something's burning Number back there. 89. What were you up to? Oh no. Oh. What the? Whoa. The green. I do not think I can pass through it. Really wants to hide it, huh? Okay, new plan. Whoa, interesting. Somnium scan. Activate. So there's gonna be that, right? There's gonna be the green that we can't pass through. Okay. Mental lock one. Two. Three. Okay. Four. Okay, four. Four mental locks. That's something. Oh. This appears to correspond to the green thing. The door? Sinking in the curtain. 89 is hiding in the past. 89 is covered in a green membrane. I can't get close. So we're supposed to clear the membrane, I guess. Uh, these are the veins from the previous thing. The winter iris, the phone. Oh, I like the music here. Prevent the interference from Whatever this is. So do we do the same thing as before? A iris that blooms in the cold. I know, I know. <laughs> uh, should we try to smell it again? It smells like a typical winter iris. What does a typical iris <laughs> smell like? I was gonna ask. Elegant and gentle. Can't you just tell me what it smells like? <laughs> I had to search online for a description, but could not find one. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Yeah, she can actually smell. Okay, so that took of time, that didn't matter ice. at all. It is green, so I imagine that will unlock something if we, if we try. Okay, let's use it on... Let's try and pick it up. 
Oh, come on. You can do it. I believe in you. What? Stop it. You're distracting me. Come on. I got one. What? Oh, and it's bloom. Aw, right after I pulled it out, too. Did the green stuff react at all? Oh. Okay. Oh. Should I pick it up? Hang up or ignore? Whoa, uh, crap. Hang up, I guess? Well... What the? I was thinking that probably is not the right idea. I fainted. Whoa. Okay, did we go on a different route or is there... I think there's just one route here. Oh, crap. Can we only choose one? Th well, I guess I'm gonna have to ignore it then. I messed up. Yeah, I was supposed to ignore it so it will play the, the thing, right? The receiver. Yeah, I get it. All right. It stopped. Oh. What was that? I don't know. No. Yeah. Okay, it's pulling back. Okay, unlock mental one. Ignore the phone. So there is no. Okay, there is no other uh, path in this one, which I makes sense. It worked. I can't imagine. Like I feel like I'm locked in this route. There is no other route to take. Uh, after this, yeah, the picture. A picture. Which, yeah, he is Just right there. Picture. Fill out or remove. Let's try and use a timey. Fill out. I don't have a pen. Oh. No choice. I must use my blood. You don't uh. have to go that far. Do you even have blood? Uh. What? <laughs> hmm. The color has returned. Hey, Iba. I said blood, but it is not the same as human blood. No okay. need to worry. And besides, we are in a dream. Sure. Still blood? It's yeah. Really better if you used a different word. For example. What? Body fluids? I do not feel comfortable with that. No, that is weird. What the heck? How are you making jokes in this type of situation? Book. Oh, is it the book from before? Oh. Read or tear. Can we even read it? I don't think we can read it. Uh, let's try and read it. How much time will we have left? I haven't been checking. Have parents or siblings. He was raised in an orphanage. F for Falco. Mm-hmm. Well, this sucks. Uh, can we go the other way? Not yet. Liquid. There is some kind of liquid pooled on the floor. Jump in, leg, smell, stick, hand in. Oh, I feel like this is gonna be one of those that punishes you if you choose wrong, right? Let's try and smell it first. That worked last time, right? With the acetone. Hmm. The smell. This is something I have smelled before at your house. But I Alcohol. You couldn't smell in the real world. <laughs> True. It is not exactly smell, but from the composition of the particles in the air. Anyway, I don't have any liquid like that in my house. Agent Dante, you've got four minutes. All right, really wasted the fill the first half of this. <laughs> Should we lick it? I feel like that makes sort of sense if we want to get into his mind. Just don't make a mess. I do not intend to. Mm -hmm. Okay, very classy way of doing it. Is... What? Wine? I knew it. I had better drink some more to be sure. Stop it, girl. <laughs> Okay, it is wine. That didn't unlock anything, so it's that's great. Fan. Oh! Is that like a giant desk fan? A desk fan only moves the air immediately around it, whereas a ceiling fan circulates air in an entire room. Oh, mm -hmm. right. Great. What if we hold on to it? Let's try that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Not like that. Like... <laughs> You know, it looks kind of majestic if you think about it. <laughs> what? Wait, did that work? No, there's no way that worked. Okay, okay. So I guess... What about... Can we do anything about the switch? switch? But there are thorns around it. Mm -hmm. Remove thorns or flip switch. We can't flip the switch, obviously. We could remove the thorns, but because they have... I, I, I that we can. Okay, let, let's try and rip the book. I'm pretty sure that's what we have to do. Yeah, half timey. Oh, there you go. It did gain some color. Whoops, sorry about my face cam. 
hate that. <laughs> it's a a phone? Pass. Yeah. What should I do? Pick it up, hang up, ignore. Let's try and picking it up this time. Let's right. see. Yeah. Who is this? Oh. What the? Oh, come on. That was wrong, right? Dang it. I was like, surely it's not gonna be the same thing, and then it was. I think I, yeah, I already Stop. messed this up. I am curious, but what if they threaten me for money? You're what? a police officer. Have some backbone. <laughs> I mean, it's true. Okay, it's closing in. Slowly but surely. Mental luck too. It took took long enough. Ignore the phone again. I suppose we didn't do anything wrong. Well, at least you didn't <laughs> faint. Well, yeah, but we used up so much time. Oh my gosh! One minute. Hurry. Less than one minute. We're dead. It's a pot. Steam is rising from it. It appears to be some kind of green curry. Maybe I don't like that. Soybean stew? It might also be boiled green juice. Yeah, what? like a slime. A <laughs> what? ninja could leap out at any moment. Well, where? What does the where mean? I kind of want to just... Wait, hold on. A book. Uh, let's read it. Yeah, let's, let's read it. Let's see what it says. F became an assassin for the Kumakuras. Rohan himself bestowed F a code name. That okay. name is Falco. Falco. Mm hmm. Okay, we're slowly going through the story, which is good. Let's try Terret. Yeah. That's sure. Yeah, I was gonna say that surely that will progress. I don't know. Maybe he used to oversee a library? I doubt Number that. 89, a librarian. <laughs> nah. I mean, he was a detective, we know that. I don't know why we're making... Oh, it didn't... I was really expecting the phone to ring, so I could ignore it. Crap, this sucks. I'm gonna run out of time. With green soup. Let's try and smell it. See what Roger. it is, at least. It smells... What oh. kind of smell? Like a gutter. Okay, so you're not gonna... One more time. Relax, you shouldn't be able to smell it anyway. You're just thinking that there's a smell. I see. Fair? You're right. <laughs> it's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so definitely I doubt... Dante, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. This is bad. This is really, really bad. What, the ceiling fan stuff? Oh no, it's, it's still going. Dang it. Thing. Blow on it, throw something head now. Nah, I doubt we can do anything about it. Liquid? There is some kind of liquid. Jump in. What if we jump in? Please tell me at least something will happen. Jump in, you say. Yeah. Jump in, Iba! Pff, you do not have to shout. <laughs> well, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> sorry. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I don't know why I listen to you. Whoops. <sighs> With the ceiling fan, the ceiling then? Fan. I'm, I'm completely lost at this point. Headbutt, blow on? Maybe blow on it? Blow on it? I guess? Nope. Oh, that stopped it? Ooh. Oh, it went the opposite way. Oh. Interesting. Okay, that did something. I have so little time left. I'm gonna run out of time. I already know. Yeah, I know. Let's heat it up. It's the last thing we can try and do, at least. It doesn't turn on. Oh. Is it broken? Great. See the phone over there? Call the manufacturer. Okay. <laughs> wow. Do you think they make dream house calls? I do not. <laughs> I do not. And we've run out of time officially. To three seconds. Green soup. Well, I guess... Nope, we're, we're done. Yeah, we can't even reach the... Date, yep. There's no time! Shit, this isn't good! Nope, it isn't. Dang it! Stick your hand in it? Are you gonna be able to do that? Yeah, okay. Ooh, you can't get through. It is surprisingly deep. Okay, then why when we jumped in it didn't work? That's weird, the Did dream logic. Anything? Oh. Oh, there is something. What Cork. the? 
Oh, wow. And it's going away. Okay. Is there going to be something in the middle? No. What is this substance? Green tea? It's no. obviously not green tea. <laughs> yeah. It's jelly. It's not jelly. <laughs> you know what it is, Iva. Stop it. Uh, I think the only one that I had left in this was where. Which I doubt is the answer, but let's try it. What? I told you to wear it. Wear it? Alright, here I go. Okay, that it seemed like that worked. Surprisingly. Uh oh. <laughs> Are you okay? I am fine, actually. <laughs> In fact, I feel as though my defense has risen. I'm okay. A worried about your head. <laughs> Why? My head is thoroughly protected. I don't know. I don't mean that. <laughs> and we need to headbutt it, right? Like so? Nope. Ow. No good. What? Huh? Your head is protected, though. What? Oh, come on. I mean, we knew we had to, to blow on it. What the heck, man? Okay. Let's see if that works. This is not gonna work because we're. Okay, no, it does. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, that, that advanced things we still we almost have a minute left okay what about the switch but there are thorns around it can you try and remove the thorns you can't flip the switch but it's right like that right surely you you, you need to rem you need to remove the thorns i will do that right Ow. oh i can't pull them out they sting me i imagine that was going to happen I guess we have to investigate without pulling them out with whatever happens to my fingers. <laughs> a switch. But there are thorns so, around it. Can you flip it before you actually Okay, let's try that. This switch again. Last time we handled it in a different manner. Mm -hmm. That was then. This is now. But what? There are thorns. You are aware that I am the one who feels the pain. Well, you know why this, eh? It'll only hurt for a bit, then it'll be better. Sure. Yeah. Oh! oh. Wow, how was I supposed to know that? What? Okay, now that's the... Okay. Got a minute left. Oh, great. What is that? I have no idea. What the hell? Whoa! It's an eye. Date, what are we going to do? What is that thing? Close curtain, poke eye, ignore, pour lemon juice. I guess if we ignored it, it's like the phone, right? Poor lemon juice. Do we have lemon juice? I guess we, we could close the curtain. Surely that will avoid them from looking. Does that work? So I guess it is. Oh, it did! Wow. Hey, Metal Lock 3, let's go! Hey, okay, okay, we're doing a little bit better something about it yes it was kind of cute what you are insane <laughs> it's pretty weird okay oh there she is tell me anyone what? else that's uh-huh i mean we're in her house makes sense right okay again the picture a picture just a picture mm-hmm what about hitomi can we talk with her it's hitomi Talk to her, kiss her, hug her, touch her. Uh, talk to her. Let's try and hug her first. Well, I suppose I will try it. I feel like that might not. Yeah, me too. Hmm? Sorry. Shut up, Date. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Date, 30 seconds. 30 seconds, I know. Uh, lift up, grab, kick, turn off. Can we turn it off? I tell we can't book. A book. Let's go. Let's uh let's read it just to see what it says. A book. I'm wasting so much time, man. I think I'm gonna have to do this. I love her again. The smile and kind words of a woman nurturing oh. Falco's withered heart back to health. Sounds like you, Date. No, hmm. not at all. Really? The nourishment is temporary. Then I go and check my wallet and it hits me. Wow. Oh, I see. You are talking about that cabaret girl again. Stop! Don't remind me. Wow. 
Okay, this is really bad. 16 seconds left. Uh, oh, there's another book here. Oh, okay, okay. So we're not supposed to tear that other one. But maybe this one we are. Okay, let's try that. Falco was in a bind and turned to a trusted friend. Oh. The rest is marked over. But I want to know Dang what it. happened after. Yeah. We all want to. Okay, one second. Oh, another book. Okay, 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 okay. A book. Let's read that one too, I guess. F stands against evildoers. <laughs> it's a freaking pot. Harsh justice. Guy sounds like Judge Dredd. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Yes. I don't know. What? <laughs> I'm guessing we're supposed to tear this one? Let's try and tear it. Here I go. Please tell me it works. Yes! What happened? Nothing. Crap! Oh, a skull! A skull. I do not see the body. Uh, talk, kiss, check, throw? We can throw it. Would that not be Two freaking seconds. Dead? dead. It's a hunk of calcium. <laughs> Alright. Sorry about this. Broke? Okay. Whose skull was this? Unknown. I don't know. I also cannot determine the connection to number 89. This is very confusing. Oh, great. Well, we ran out of time anyway, so I guess we should just try and re retry. <sighs> I don't know. Maybe something will work, but we'll see. Let's try and grab. Oh, we're close to the ending anyway. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, okay? that did something. Is that gonna progress? Looks okay. Yeah, but it looks. What, what the? Who's that? You have less than two minutes. Hurry. What do uh -oh. we do? I don't know. Uh, ignore. I guess ignore. Sheesh. Shut. Shut up. Just yeah. Just ignore it. Like the like the phone. Her face. Was that not the right thing to do? Oh, great. Iva, wake up. Wait, there's a. What happened? My body is heavy. What the? Oh, we're gonna lose so much time here. Open then? No thanks. I don't want any. Well. Nope, yep, that's bad. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, luck, right? Oh, I didn't, I didn't realize it wasn't locked. I should have checked that before, duh. Oh, what the? Oh. What? Is that what no, happened? Stop! What the? Wait, 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 what? Stop right there. Oh. Boss. What? Was Boss the accomplice then? Whoa. Okay, this is very weird. <laughs> I don't know what's happening anymore. Day four, Monday. Kick eye? Okay. Wish I knew what that means. Whoa. This is a serious matter. Oh, very Boss. serious. Huh? Boss, where is she? Uh, I don't know. I haven't seen her since about noon. Damn it. Dotty, listen. Something happened while you were in Somnium. Huh? What? Please stay calm and listen. What? So Sejima's body was discovered. Oh. He was cut into pieces and put inside a vase in his mansion. That what the heck? Be. The housekeeper found him and reported it to the police. And one more thing. So was missing his left eye. You mean the Cyclops killer did it? Probably, yes. 
The new Cyclops killer. Boy, this is, is your next move, Date. I gotta stop. I can't. We'll deal with so later. Before yeah. that, I need to talk to boss. It's like I don't care about this corrupted politician, my best friend. Good idea. Yep. Where is she? Crap. The summoning earlier was just like the dream I had three days ago. What the hell yep. is going on? What is sure going was. On? I don't know, man. I have no idea. To protect number 89? So that's why her arm is not working? And there's another thing I can figure out. Boss. Yeah, what Why the heck? Boss there? Because it was a dream? Was it completely random? No, <laughs> that can't be. <laughs> I don't, can't yeah, I don't think so. Face you've never seen. Number right. Must know boss somehow. Mm hmm. And it's very mysterious that she knows she's not around. This is a serious secret. Boss is hiding it. I have to search this room. There must be a clue somewhere. Okay, but before we do that, I'm gonna leave the episode right here, guys. I'm sorry, I don't want to stop either. I honestly don't. But uh, we gotta find out the secret. Hopefully we'll do next time again. Hopefully we'll be done with this um, with this route soon. Because I am not liking the way that this route went. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching once again. Uh, hope you enjoyed. I definitely did. I mean, better than the ending of the previous one. I was just not feeling great at all. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching once again. I'm Lucy Nail, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. This truck is very Danganronpa, I like it too.